Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a cook and a clean with me. It is going to be an ultimate clean with me. I'm going to be cleaning different areas in my house and then I will also take you along with me when I cook dinner. I cook dinner in the crock pot on this night. Also, I usually always film a before and after of my house on how it's looking when I do any type of cleaning or organizing videos. And this time around, I just completely forgot to film a before, before I started cleaning, but there will be an after. So hopefully you guys don't mind that I forgot to film the before. And I hope that you guys enjoy this cook and ultimate clean with me. I also want to apologize for all of the lighting change. I'm not sure why, but with my new camera or my new phone that I record on, anytime I get to a certain angle, the lighting just completely changes. It never did that with my old phone. So I'm gonna try to fix that soon. So I do apologize about all of the different lighting that you're going to see throughout the video.
really love this board and I need to start using it more often. I found it on clearance a while back at Target and I had I love you on it for a really long time. So I decided to change it out to it's fall y'all since it is fall time. Does anyone else love vacuuming? I don't know why, but for some reason, I really do enjoy vacuuming. And I also really love the vacuum lines. Anytime I vacuum and I see those fresh vacuumed lines, I love it. And I seriously don't want anyone to walk over it.
this recipe that I'm putting into the crock pot is a recipe that I found on Pinterest so I will pin it down below it was kind of like a mac and cheese with chicken in it I did have to substitute a lot of things just because my husband is super super picky so there's a lot of things in the recipe that I had to replace it for something else that I knew that my husband would like and eat but if any of you guys are interested in this recipe I will link it down below for you guys to check out it was super good and delicious and my husband loved it and so did Madison. I also did not go by any of the measurements in the recipe I just eyeballed everything I've always been like that anytime I make a recipe I always just eyeball it and do my own measurements so feel free to check out the recipe for exact measurements Okay guys, so now this is the end of my cook and ultimate clean with me and this is the after of how my house was looking or at least the upstairs because that is the areas that I cleaned for this video. So I really do enjoy a clean house. This was on Saturday and I love to spend the weekends at home and have a clean house and the house was also smelling amazing between all the amazing cleaning products I used and also the food that was in the crock pot. My house was smelling so good. You're going to see that Ryan and Madison's bed did not have their bed sheets on it just because they were still in the wash. I was washing both of their bed sheets and pillowcases. And now that my chicken is completely done cooking, it has been sitting in the crock pot for about six hours. I just go in with two forks and I shred up all the chicken. It is very easy to shred the chicken because it is nice and tender and pretty much just falls apart. So once I'm done doing that, I'm then going to boil some pasta and I decide to go with some bow tie pasta just because that's the pasta my husband likes. You can choose any pasta you would like. And then once the pasta is done cooking, I just toss it into my crock pot. This recipe also called for some sour cream. My husband does not like sour cream, so I just decided to put in a little bit of heavy whipping cream, and then I also added some cheddar cheese. I mixed it all up very well, and then I topped it off with a little more sprinkled cheddar cheese on top, closed the lid, and let it sit in there for another, I would say, 10 minutes, and then it was completely done, and it was a really delicious dinner. My husband and daughter really loved it. Okay guys, so that is going to end my cook and clean with me for today. I really hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. 
I really don't think I've ever done a cook and clean with me. So I enjoyed doing this video. If you guys would like me to start doing more cook and clean with me videos, then remember to give this video a big thumbs up. And also let me know down in the comments. And then I definitely will start filming these videos for you guys more often. As always, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, give the video a big thumbs up. And remember to subscribe to my channel if you have not already. I would love to have you join me in my YouTube family. And as always, thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate each and every one of you guys. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.